In Minnesota, we all know what it feels like to be painfully cold. Some families may not be able to afford coats for their kids this winter. A breakout star of the Minnesota Vikings defense is making sure hundreds of Twin Cities kids have a warm gift for cold days. Winter coats and hats sat on over a dozen tables in the multi-purpose room at Nellie Stone Johnson Elementary School in North Minneapolis. Right over there. Class after class filed in as students got to pick out a new winter coat of their own. Do you like that color? That looks good. Let me see. They were so proud and excited to receive that. It's like a sense of safety knowing that, you know, I now have this. You know, and they don't have to worry about that when when the cold comes. Principal Kelly Wright says it's a sense of safety for her as well. A large number of students' families here are homeless, highly mobile, or English learners. We actually try to get a lot of things donated or spend a lot of our other dollars trying to meet the needs, which are sometimes so great for us. After finding their perfect fit, there you go. They picked up a Vikings knit hat. What these kids didn't know was that a new Viking making a big impact on the team was among those behind the gift or that they get a chance to meet him. I just want to use my platform to be able to give back. Linebacker Andrew Van Ginkle and United Healthcare teamed up to provide over 400 coats and hats and something else every kid needs, confidence and encouragement. Have a great year this year and keep up with those grades. Van Ginkle fired up the kids at the pep rally by starting a skull chant. Go, go. And inviting students to move. So is there anybody out here that knows how to dance? All right, let's see it. The kids did their best gritty. Awesome job. The educators were well represented by visual arts and technology teacher William Watkins. Oh, that was great. Van Ginkle kept his moves to himself. I'm not a dancer. I, <laughs> I'll leave that to the kids and Justin Jefferson. Green stripe or the blue top, I think. Yeah, I'll take this one. Along with the coats, Van Ginkle and the team at United Healthcare also provided this hygiene locker filled with soap, deodorant, toothpaste, and mouthwash. They're also helping stock this room with other warm clothes and necessities. A lot of our families are starting over. They're newcomers to the country. They don't have anything. For Van Ginkle and his wife, Sam, that one? charitable efforts like this one are a big part of their life. Me and my wife just created a foundation, so, um, you know, it's finding ways to bring joy and excitement. There you go. That looks good. Minnesota's special. you got a lot of people here that really care. Van Ginkle is also giving back to his hometown of Rock Valley, Iowa. It's still recovering from major flooding that affected 540 homes in the city this summer. He started the Van Ginkle Impact Foundation to help them and others.